Alright, sorry about that guys, but today I have an unboxing from Amazon and I'm not gonna use my intro because I'm too excited. So this is the 3x3x6, the cubic 3x3x4, and last but not least, the great gear cube. Yes. I am sorry, my sister's asked me something. I don't have time to edit this. I'm so excited. Yes, I do. So, uh, here's the package. I'm going to leave my address facing me. And let's just open this package up. <coughs> and what is it? I just got, I'll show you it. Okay. Got some room. So, here we are. So... Here they are, and I'm super excited. I'm like, just go. So, whoopsie doopsie. Sorry about that. Accidentally hit. You know, I'll come back. Okay, sorry about that. Got that settled. So, here we go. Here is the 3D gear cube. And this was 3D printed from Shapeways for me. This was pretty expensive. This was about $30 or $40. So, I'm excited to get into this. I have the cube for you, cubic 3x3x4, and the Wit Eden 3x3x6. So yeah, sorry about the noise in the background, but here we go. So let's just get right into the gear cube first because you can already see it. And first impressions, it looks pretty, these aren't going to be really long because I'm so excited. Um, first impressions is this puzzle looks really, really professional. And, oh yeah, oh yeah, we're into the puzzle. So first, it's pretty greasy. Um, you can clearly see that it's made with shape waste material, so let's just get into the turning. Ooh. Okay, so, <clears throat> first turns, very greasy. And I think this is gonna need a lot of breaking in and lubing because just this puzzle turns not very good right now. I'm not satisfied with the turning. It's kind of blocky, and it wants to hold itself together. And when you try and turn it, it's just hard to turn. So, yeah, this is, this is I already know how to solve this puzzle. So, I'm not going to be too scared for solving it. So, yeah, let's just get into our next puzzle, which will be the cube for you, 3 by 3 by 4 So, let's just use my handy little knife here. Just open dish. Open dish puzzle box because I actually want to keep the box for this. This is going to be very important. So just be quiet a little bit. Here it is. The cubic 3x3x4. Three by three by pretty greasy and it's pretty cool. So let's just get straight into the turning. Okay so first impressions this puzzle is very smooth. It's smooth it has a crunchy feel to it. Like, here, let me hold it up to the mic up my cam. Look, ready? Whoop! One of the center caps actually just fell off. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but that's pretty crunchy. So, yeah, this is going to need some lubing, breaking in, and tons of other stuff. So, yeah. I'm gonna have to get this set up. Let me just put it back. So yeah, there you go. That's basically it for this. So um, yeah, I'm keeping the box for this. Let's just get into the three by three by six. Okay, first impressions. Compared to the three by three Rubik's cube, it is almost twice its size. This is supposed to. This is a ginormous puzzle. Anyway, let's just get to the turning. Whoa, holy cow. This has extremely, very smooth turning. Probably the smoothest turning I've seen in a cuboid. Holy cow. That's so smooth. That's nuts, it's so smooth. So, I'm guessing it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't shape shift. But yeah, this is a really cool puzzle. So, um, I'll do this algorithm on it, but yeah. 
this is pretty pretty cool puzzle so yeah just um sorry for all the things in the background everybody's busy so yeah i think that's it for this unboxing you might see another one come out tonight and um yeah just like and question of the day will be which is your favorite out of these three the cubic three by three by four three by three by six or game cube go ahead and subscribe if you're new that'd be very good appreciated goodbye